Deborah, welcome to Woman Voice Network. I want to thank you once again for being here with us. I know you're being a very big help to us to bring awareness to domestic violence and all those other compelling issues. What are some other things that we could do? Thank you so much, Iris. I am very happy to be with you today. Thanks for the invitation. Well, when we're speaking specifically about child sexual abuse, um, which is right, so as the Advocacy Center, uh, we've been working with uh, victims of uh, child sexual abuse for over 25 years. Now we work with physical abuse and, and, and sex trafficking, but 25, for 25 years we've been, we've been working with child sexual abuse. And so I think the first thing that we, we ask the community to know is to educate yourselves, right? Take a class, go to our website or go to, there's many uh, um, agencies and organizations in the United States that are experts in this um, and, and, and get a clear understanding as to what the data is telling us about child sexual abuse, right? One in four girls and one in six boys wow. will be sexually abused before they reach the age of 18. Um, almost 40% of all child sexual abuse is child on child. So, you know, be careful when you are hiring a teenager, girl or boy, to take care of your younger children. Um, we also know that um, 60 to 90% of the time, the offender uh, of child sexual abuse, the offender is either a family member or someone that the family knows. knows yeah. So the, the, the belief of, you know, the stranger and be careful and the stranger danger, stranger danger. Yes, we want our we want our kids to be mindful and we want adults to be mindful of strangers. But the offenders when it comes to sexual abuse are those individuals who have access to the child. Did you offer the the children or the kids a place to stay or you work with the family, Department of Family and Children? We were so we are uh, Christie House is, is not a residential place. We're, we are the uh, an advocacy center, the mm -hmm. Children's Advocacy Center of Miami-Dade County. We are under the umbrella um, of the National Children's Alliance. The National Children's Alliance um, is charged with the accreditation of advocacy centers, and there's over 900 advocacy centers in the United States. 700 of those are accredited, which means that there's ongoing criteria, improvement of criteria that we have to strive to achieve, and the um, Children's Alliance supports us to make sure that we're meeting that criteria. Mm -hmm. Okay. So sort of like an audit of, of sorts. All of these agencies are involved. And then Christie House, what we do is that we provide the therapy, the trauma-focused cognitive behavioral therapy. We have the social workers, our family advocates, that may have an assessment as well to make sure that the family has everything that need they need during this time. Okay. And whatever we cannot provide, then we refer it out to an agency whom we have already vetted.